Do you know email marketing is one of the most effective strategies for businesses to reach out their customers one on one? In fact, there are over 4 billion of users using email daily in their business communication or personal use. And I would say for every brand, they should invest in email marketing. Why? Because for every $1 that you put in, it can potentially earn you $44 back as a return of investment. If you want to have a successful email marketing strategy, there are several best practices that you need to know so that you can ensure that your email is being delivered to your customer successfully. In this video, I will share with you the six tips of the email best practices so that you can ensure your email marketing strategy is a success. Let's deep dive in right now. Tip number one is to build a targeted email list and segment it by interest. There are two reasons why you need to do that. The first is to reduce your unsubscribe rate and make you appear less spammy. Now, when your subscribers subscribe to your email list, let's say for example, uh, they have downloaded your ebook or watch a video, it is based on different interests. So by doing that, you can send valuable content based on their interests to help you boost your email marketing campaign efficiency. Tip number two is to personalize your email. Now, how do you do that? There are a few ways you can do it. Firstly, you can put in your email subscriber name on the email subject line or you can put it inside the email body copy. And the second way is let's say for example, if you want to welcome your email subscribers, you can take a picture of yourself with a customized message to welcome them and place it at the end of the email body copy. Now, the reason why you need to do this is because you want to make your email more personal. Imagine you are writing an email to a friend and attention to their name. If let's say, for example, I'm your friend and I saw my name on the email subject line, I'm more prone to open it because it's attention to me. So in order to have a successful email marketing strategy, you need to ensure that your email is written in a personal way rather than a corporate way. Tip number three is to make sure that your email is being configured to be mobile friendly. Why? Because most of your users will check their email using mobile because it's so convenient nowadays. And don't assume that they will open your email using their desktop or laptop or tablet. And if you don't do that, let's say for example, if your email is not being configured properly, it may appear distorted in their mobile phone. Like for example, their font size, the alignment. And when they saw your email, they may end up delete your email straight away. So always make sure that your email is being configured to be mobile friendly. Tip number four is to use an attention grabbing email subject line. Why? Because this is the first thing that they will see when they receive your email. And if your email subject line is not curious enough, for them to open up your email, they will straight away delete your email. And how do you do that? You can put in emotions in the email subject line, for example, like desire, fear, or empathy. So these are the few key things that you can do to attract them to open up your email if you have a captivating email subject line. Tip number five is to send out a test mail to your own email accounts first before you even send out to your email subscribers. For example, you can create a test mail to send out to your own Outlook, your own Gmail, your Yahoo Mail, or even your company email account. Now, there are two things that you need to take note. First is to make sure that your email is being delivered successfully to each individual different accounts. Second is to check for any hyperlink errors or maybe your text alignment or your font size. Does it look okay in different accounts? Because you do not know your subscribers is using which email service provider. So the best thing is to check each individual account to see whether you have a very good user experience. This will affect whether your subscribers is going to delete your email or continue to read your email. Tip number six, which is the last tip, is to analyze your data using the email metrics. 
I'm talking about your open rate, click through rate, your bounce rate, or your unsubscribe rate, etc. And why is it important to monitor your email metrics? It's because by understanding these metrics, you will able to segment out which are the high performing emails and the low performing emails. And you try to make some tweaks in terms of your email subject line, your email body copy, or even your call to action link. And split test to see which one works better so that you can continue using that kind of email to send out to your subscribers. So by having a great insights about what your audience like, then you will able to make an informed decision for your future email marketing campaign. I hope this video is beneficial for you to give you an insight of what are the best email practices to deliver a successful email marketing strategy. Well, that's all for now and I'll see you next time.